frequencies that um, are used. 5550 is uh, New York. And uh, there's a great web page that I'll share with you guys. So if you want to know, um, you know, what are the different uh, routes or routes that airplanes take over the Atlantic Ocean and the ocean and around the world, uh, this page here, maintained by uh, WB2KQG, um, has some really nice um, information and actually will tell you um, a little bit about, you know, what you're listening to. So, in this case, uh, you'll have the uh, different um, airways or the, basically it's like the um, roads that planes use in the air, uh, basically. So this is the different, so you got North Atlantic family A and so, and you got beautiful maps also that you can click on and see where and what actually the planes are following and the different frequencies that they are using too. You can even print them out, which is really nice. And you see each frequency used and what stations are also on this frequency. So right now we're on 5550. See, we need to actually find where is 5550 in the frequencies here that also has New York in them. So if you look at North Atlantic, and here's Caribbean. So what we're hearing here, 5550, we just see it here, is the Caribbean Area A. So that means the plane that we just heard is in the vicinity here and using one of those 
Caribbean uh, routes to actually um, the plane is somewhere in there. That's the region that this actually is um, using. So each frequencies and the different stations have specific areas that they monitor and the planes are in. And when they change, if a plane changes uh, from one area to another, then they will have to shift on the different frequencies. And actually, that's what he was telling uh, the plane here. He was saying that after he reaches a certain area near the Bermuda, um, he has to change to 5520 that you have here, which is a different frequency for a different area for the air traffic. So um, this is, I'm going to put this in the, uh, this link in the uh, description below so you guys can look at it. Uh, it's very beautiful, beautiful maps in all the frequencies of the different um, areas that uh, planes actually use uh, around the world. So it's very, very nice and very complete. So uh, HF Radio Major World Air Routes Areas, uh, so or what we call Moara. Uh, for short. So all the info is here and then you can just punch in those frequencies of air traffic that's closest to you and listen in like here for example. And the set of tones that you hear is called its cell call or selective calling. So what it actually does is it light up a little, um, you know, light on the panel of the plane to let you know that uh, somebody's trying to call you. So each plane is assigned a specific set of codes like this so that the air traffic control station can actually call you back and let you know that uh, they want to contact you, basically. So uh, they'll, of course, set different tones for different planes. And uh, when the air traffic wants to, wants to uh, contact them, what well, they'll do is they'll send a set of codes for the specific plane they want to talk to. And that plane will get a notification that they're being uh, called by air traffic control. <laughs> 